All right, hey you guys, welcome to my channel. So I've got a very anticipated unit for you guys. This is from Yolissa Hair. This is their blonde unit, Dark Roots 613. Um, it is in body wave, 13 by four transparent lace front wig. It is 180% density, large cap, and it is 24 inches. So this is the hairline, you guys. I did go ahead and pluck a little bit more off of camera, and I gave her a little um, wash as well, hung her out to dry. And now we're just gonna go ahead and apply this unit. So my wig cap is super obvious right now, but it won't be once everything's all said and done. But if you do the ball cap method, um, this is perfect to do that kind of method on like the perfect wig because the hair is blonde, it's light brown. Um, you want it to look as flawless as possible, especially if you're gonna keep this on. So you guys, this is the same unit that I posted on Instagram, my little reel here, and you guys absolutely loved it. Thank you guys so much um, for all the kind words words but you guys really wanted to know um about this unit so this is it this is the hair from Yalissa and I am in love with this color it's so much fun I never wear blonde like this um and I think I should start you guys what do you think let me know in the comments but yeah um I'm just going in and just getting this um, lace melted as best as I can um, you guys I don't do the ball cap method just in case you're new here I don't do that simply because I take my wigs off every single day and it's not always like I don't wear a wig every single day basically I wear my natural hair all the time um, some days I wear my wig some days I do not but here I'm going in and adding um, just doing my edges doing my hairline um, I'm just gonna do two swoops, keeping it very simple. I feel like this hair did not need much as far as like uh, details go. It's very just pop on go wearable. It did need a lot of work, you guys, which is perfect for me. So I'm just gonna do two little swoops as far as my edges go and lay these bad boys down. And if you guys are interested, all the products that I ever use like in my videos as far as like hair goes and just whatever I'm showing in my videos um, will be listed in my Amazon store. I have different sections in there. So I've got stuff for wig videos, natural hair. I've got like just things that I love for my home. I got a whole bunch of stuff up in there, you guys. So make sure you always check out my Amazon store if you're curious about the products I'm using. And then of course with this unit, I will make sure everything is down below in the description box. All the details will be down there for you guys. So next I'm just moving along um, and just adding my wax stick to the roots of my hair and then I'm just going to use my hot comb to get this as flat as possible. This is the combination. I know everyone knows this by now, but if you don't, make sure you have a wax stick. Make sure you got have a hot comb. The both do not, they do not need to be super expensive, but this is the combo for you to get your unit as flat as possible. Another way to do it is doing it on a mannequin head. That helps tremendously. I actually lost the piece for my mannequin head. It's somewhere in my disaster of a closet. So I couldn't get it as flat as I wanted to, which is I wanted to do this whole style on a mannequin head, but wasn't possible. Here 
here, you guys, I'm just going in really lightly with my croc flat iron. Um, I didn't really want to take all the volume out of this body wave um, unit. I still wanted some, you know, I just didn't want to be super flat. And next I'm taking my T3 curling iron right here. And I'm just curling my hair in different ways. I just wanted a little bit of volume. I didn't need the curls to be uniform or anything like that. I just didn't want to wear this hair straight. So I'm just adding a few curls all throughout this unit. So I use my curling iron as like a wand and a curling iron. I don't know, I couldn't find my actual wand curler and I just wanted to try something different. It took okay, the hair took okay to heat, but it wasn't the best. So you will need some hairspray. Also, I did get some shedding with this unit, which I knew I would. I always get shedding when it comes to, especially units that have color in them. But other than that, no other issues with the hair. The hair was soft, um, it, no smells, no anything you guys, um, full ends as well. So yeah, so I'm just gonna finish up curling this hair um, and then I'm just going to use my fingers to comb out the curls. Um, like I said, I just wanted a little bit of body with this look, um, nothing like, I don't need like a whole bunch like really big curls and all that kind of stuff. Just a little something so it's not so flat and boring. And then I'm just gonna use a little bit of hairspray right here at the roots. Um, if you wanna get like a little lift, this is what I do. I just use my hairspray and then I take um, some heat. So whatever I have plugged up and that just holds it. So that gives it, gives it like a little lift in the front, gives you a, so it's not so flat, just in case, you know, if you like that style. I used to not do this. I just started doing this maybe like a year ago. Um, I do it sometimes, not all, but yeah, I just like the look of it. Gives it a little bit more of a natural look too. And then I'm just gonna add some concealer to my parts in the lace. And that's basically it for this look, you guys. Um, I will put, like I said, all the information down below in the description box for you guys. I hope you like the outcome of it. I love this. I love the switch up of this unit. I still will rock my black hair, but it's so good to have a unit like this when you just want something different and Yalissa did that with this one. So thank you guys so much for watching. I'll talk to you guys in my next one. Bye.